Hi, I'm Martin Luke Brown, and this song is called Nostalgia. Was it clear when you wrote that song that you were in that frame of mind? You were you were feeling a little melancholy looking back, or is that something that dawns on you once the song's finished? That that it's almost like a subliminal type thing going on. Yeah, yeah, that. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, quite often I'll, I'll sort of have like a word or a little phrase or a lyric and start from that and build the music around it in like a general mood, and I'll begin writing it. And quite often I will have written like two thirds of a song before I realise what I actually mean. And then that's the point where I think, right, I better go back and craft it a bit and make sure this makes sense. And uh, yeah, and then I kind of listen back to it afterwards and think, yeah, 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 that's 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 what I meant, even though I didn't realise that at the time. But it, it must be great to, to let your heart do the writing in the first instance, though, mustn't it? Yeah, I think it's nice. Like I, I, I'm definitely a, a doer. I, I don't really reflect on stuff that much unless I am songwriting. I just sort of try and keep living and don't think about anything too much and just you know keep going and I think the times where I do sit down and write a song it's kind of like intense thinking periods and reflecting so I sort of write down everything I'm feeling it all kind of gets piled into the song and then once it's written I'll just move on and yeah it's, it's nice it's kind of like a diary I guess 
You're a prolific writer in your own right, but what about in terms of... You're in London, there are loads of writers down there. What about liaising with people? Is there anything to be gained by doing some sort of cross-pollination between different writers? Does that go on? Yeah, I, yeah, definitely. I mean, I've, I've worked with quite a few producers that, that write as well and done, done some co-writes and stuff. And, yeah, it's great. People, people have different strengths. And I think initially, like, at the, at the start of my little musical journey, I was quite arrogant in the sense that I was like, nope, I want to do everything on my own. I want to be the only guy that writes. You know, I want to play, like, all of the instruments and stuff. And you kind of hit a point and you just think, for the good of the song, like, the song, once you've finished it, it kind of becomes its own entity, really. And... It needs to be the best it can be, not just something that you can show off and be like, no, this is all me. So, yeah, it, it's been great. Like, um, We worked with a couple of uh, guys. Uh, there was a guy called Phil Cook who's done the single Nostalgia, and he's, he's great. He's, he's great. We really got a good uh, connection, and we kind of bounce off, and, yeah, it's good. Uh, this one's called Lust Again. Ooh. Not beheaded little boy Swallowing the plastic tie With open eyes that see the world in Not the lies that I've been told Oh, my love has gone to waste Falling flat down on my face the future's right behind my back I'm heading off this track mm, Cause I wanna be lost again Nothing in my way, yeah I wanna be lost again Far away from here, yeah I wanna be lost again Find a brand new place, yeah I wanna be lost Again. Oh, lost again. Ooh, ooh. And ooh, ooh. I remember when day seemed like the dirt left on my chubby cheeks. Tiny feet on steeper hills yeah. without the shoes they had to fill oh, oh my love won't go to waste I won't fall down on my face the future's right behind my back so I'm heading off this track I've got to be lost again and nothing in my way yeah we're gonna be lost again And do you- 